Wildcat Hills State Recreation Area in western Nebraska. We're located just eight miles south of Gearing, and our habitat out here is a little bit different than on the eastern part of the state. Um, our average rainfall is 10 to 12 inches, so a lot of our plant life and our ecosystems are drought tolerant. Um, so we have some unique species out here for plants that maybe you don't see on the eastern side of the state, as well as some interesting wildlife that goes along with that. So we have bighorn sheep out here, elk. We also have grassland species like pronghorn and um, ponderosa pine specific species like red crossbills, um, which is a small songbird that feeds on our um, pine cone seeds out here. Out at the Wildcat Hills, we're mainly a ponderosa pine um, woodland. Um, so we have a lot of ponderosa pines. And then we're in a short grass to mixed grass um, prairie as well. So a lot of our plants are a little bit lower growing due to that, that average rainfall out here. The Wildcat Hills are very unique. Um, they don't look like a lot of the, the rest of the state. So on the eastern side of the state, we see a lot of open fields and croplands. And as you work your way west, we have a lot of rocky buttes and ponderosa pine woodlands. So it's very unique. So we're similar to the eastern part of the state. We are a little drier out here. Um, and I think our average rainfall, like I mentioned earlier, is a little lower than the eastern part of the state. So what we're also dealing with out here is drought um, and wildfire dangers as well. So out here in western Nebraska, we are a little drier out here, but we have unique species that are adapted for those drier environments with different wildlife and different plants. So some of the plants that you can grow on the eastern end of the state, we maybe get to grow some slightly different ones out here. So we invite everyone to come out here to western Nebraska and see all these unique species.